but my experience is that when I talk to people about it and say, how come nobody else is talking about this? I feel a lot of lights going on in people's heads saying, mm. yeah, that actually is what we ought to be talking about. We ought to be talking about diabetes. We ought to be talking about, um, you know, uh, Alzheimer's, which, which, you know, we talked at lunch that Alzheimer's recently was reclassified as type three diabetes. And people now understand that it's, it's dietary mm. that we're poisoning this whole generation. Shouldn't we be talking about that? Shouldn't we be talking about the fact that we have a thousand ingredients in our foods that are illegal in other countries, in Europe, et cetera, and that, you know, um, we're, we're just systematically poisoning this generation of kids. When I talk about it, people, I feel like people's light, lights go on and they mm -hmm. say, yeah, that is what this election should be about. It shouldn't be about the fear. I think People will want to talk about those issues. They want to solve those issues and that the solution and that the, the, the RNC and the DNC don't want people talking about it they, because they're both paid by BlackRock and BlackRock owns the processed food companies that are poisoning us and they own the, the pharmaceutical companies that are making $4.3 trillion a year, five times our defense budget treating the chronic disease that's being caused by BlackRock's other, you know, group of companies. BlackRock owns all the military contractors, General Dynamics, North of Grumman, uh, uh, Boeing, Lockheed, et cetera, that are destroying all the ports and bridges and schools and, you know, roads in Ukraine. And they also have the contract for rebuilding Ukraine. Right. So you, right. you have, you know, both parties are both, being supported by BlackRock, both of them are the war party, and both of them are kind of captured of that system. And um, and the you know, and it, it's all the the issues that are that are um that that would challenge their hegemony over our democracy are issues that are never talked about. Although when Americans hear about them, so Americans think, oh, this election is about abortion, and guns at the border. That's all the news. By the way, CNN, they're all ultimately owned by BlackRock, too. So you're in this closed loop bubble where you're not allowed to really talk about what's important. And everybody thinks, oh, elections are about abortions, guns, and the border, and about hating the other guy. And when you start talking about the issues that are really important to people the chronic disease, the debt, the addiction to war, Restoring our soils, having healthy foods. They, I, I see that there's a tremendous receptivity both by Republicans and Democrats. And of course, they want to make sure Republicans and Democrats never get together on anything.